If you're planning on selling your home this spring, is your home prepared for the spring real estate market? In a previous video, we talked about getting yourself ready. So now let's talk about getting your home ready for the spring market. Hi, I'm Kelly Nitz of the Kelly Nitz team. Thanks for joining me today. Once a seller prepares themselves and their families for the spring real estate market, now it's time to make sure that their home is prepared. It's very important that when selling your home, whether it's during the spring market or not, that you understand how to prepare your home for the real estate market. Here's a quick rundown of many of the interior, exterior, and general tasks that should be completed prior to listing your home during the spring real estate market. Here are some of the most important interior tasks to complete when preparing your home for sale. Many of them are low cost or even no cost items that will only require a little bit of time and effort. First, clean the windows. You'd be surprised on how much better and different they look once you clean them. Also, take all the light bulbs and replace them with fresh ones because when you first use a light bulb, that's when it's the brightest. So go ahead and replace all the light bulbs in the whole house. Um, and then wash and polish any flooring um, that's a necessity to do that. Vacuum and steam clean any carpeting. Get rid of any type of odor. There are products out there you can use if you have pets that you know have odor in your carpet or smoke smell or something like that. Um, dust all the surfaces including your ceiling fans and the top of your hot water heater and those kinds of things. Organize all your closets. Less is better. Pack up your winter clothes and store them away so you just have, looks like you have plenty of space in your closet. Declutter, get rid of things that are just laying around. Uh, repaint and neutralize all the rooms if necessary. And deep clean your appliances, especially underneath the hood at the top of the stove range. Um, get in there and look on, at the underneath side. People miss that many times and that can get really gross up there, so make sure you clean that. Curb appeal can make a big difference when it comes time to whether or not the buyer chooses to look inside of your property. They'll do a drive-by and if the exterior looks run down and not taken care of, they may not want to go on the inside. So make sure you take care of the curb appeal. It's one of the most important factors. Kind of sets the tone for the showing. So it's important to prepare that, you know, take care and prepare the exterior of your home, freshen it up with some spring flowers, clean up the sidewalks and all that and get ready for the spring market. Some more of the exterior things that you want to take care of is if you have an asphalt driveway, maybe get it resealed. If you have some raised concrete that could be a trip hazard, maybe get some cement pumped underneath that to even it up. Um, like I said, to put some fresh flowers out and fresh mulch and trim any bushes or shrubs and plant some nice, pretty, bright colored flowers outside. Um, any peeling paint or chip paint or um, faded paint, you want to make sure it looks nice and fresh and a, and a good paint job. Wash the siding or power wash it. Sometimes it might need power wash if um, moss grows on the side of the house. Maybe you got a tree close by and it creates uh, some moss growing on your house. Make sure you power wash that off. And make sure you clean out your gutters and, and um, downspouts. And make sure the downspouts are fully extended. Um, that gives the appearance that you take care of your home. And give the, the roof a good inspection. See if there's any shingles missing and make sure around the chimney the seal is tight and everything. There are also some very specific home maintenance tasks that the homeowners should complete prior to putting their house on the market. It could be easy to detect if a homeowner doesn't care for their house or not just by simply walking through it and looking at these items. Um, so here, here's some of the important things that you really need to make sure are well maintained before um, you put the house on the market for the spring market. Make sure you change your filters in your furnace and give a good wipe down of the exterior of your furnace. It just gives a much better appearance and it'll look like you maintain your furnace. So um, take a look at that and, and also, as I said before, wipe off the top of the hot water heater and get all the dust out of the area, spider webs and all that. Um, evaluate the efficiency of your home. Um, see if you have any look around your window, see if they're all, they all seal tight. Make sure there isn't any cracked glass that have um, accumulated or um, just check the efficiency of the home. And also inspect the plumbing. Turn out all the water faucets. Make sure that the pressure is good and make sure there's no water dripping under the sink. Um, those are some very important home maintenance tips. Depending on the condition of your home, there could be more things added to the list. So 
these are the bare, this is the bare minimum that you should consider taking a look at before putting your house on the market. Um, some people even decide to have like a pre-home inspection um, that could be helpful also. Anyway, I'd like to thank you for allowing me to share this information with you today. If you liked it, click the like button. And if you'd like to receive more videos as they become available, just subscribe below and you'll be notified when the next video is available. And finally, if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section. We love to hear what our people are thinking and, and talking about. And um, if you have any questions about preparing your home for sale, we'd love to assist you with that. And also up here, you'll see the information button. You can click on that and you'll be directed to the website, which has a real estate blog and all other kinds of useful information that you may need while doing a home search or thinking about selling your home. Thanks again for joining me.